my name is Trey Hill. Um, I farm in Rock Hall, Maryland. Uh, we're on the shores of the Chesapeake Bay and we grow corn, uh, wheat and soybeans on a little over 10,000 acres. Based on my experiences over, the, over my career, um, we started as a very conventional farm and then we've come to cover crop and plant green and do all these things. And what we've been doing in that process over the last decade or two is we've created healthier soils. Uh, we didn't know we were doing it at the time. I would say the term healthy soils really came into my vernacular, my vocabulary within the last three to four years. But what we were doing on our farm, as I look at a lot of the other farmers that are kind of leading the way in the soil health movement is we were all doing this based on agronomy and financials. Um, for me, there were a big part of it was, was environmental. Um, I'm an environmentalist here on the shore. Um, we have to be, it's a very socially acceptable thing. We have river keepers, we have the Bay Foundation, we have just a lot of environmental folks. Um, so there's a lot of social pressure uh, to do that. So we've been developing the system that long and then it kind of dovetails um, really nicely into climate smart farming. Um, so as you're building healthy soils, what that is is growing plants, creating both photosynthesis more days of the year, which is converting carbon out of the air into the soil and then no-till keeps the soil from releasing it. I feel like it's the best way to farm. Uh, as farmers have changed the way they farm, we're seeing uh, the quality of the water in our waterways improve. Um, just at my house, I've got uh, subaquatic vegetation that we've never had before. Um, we've got um, dolphins coming into the Chester River that we've never had in my lifetime. So we're seeing marked things that are better for water quality, due in large part to farmers doing a better job. So to me, seeing that incremental improvement over my lifetime or over the last decade provides a lot of hope. But as climate change, as the climate changes and we get the bigger rains, then the impact of agriculture becomes greater. So the necessity for farmers to improve the way they farm becomes greater to me. Um, so that's why I look at it personally, is that it's, it's as much altruistic as anything. It doesn't have to be, probably has to be that I need to be proud of what I'm doing.